Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel, thanks for watching. I thought I'd just do a quick video today on a few bits that I picked up on a shopping trip to Meadowhall in Sheffield yesterday and then the doorbell's just gone and a delivery from somewhere that I've never ordered from before called, let me get it right, Calzedonia. Now, they were mentioned on Lorna Lux's, um, I'm guessing it was her Insta Instagram story and basically they sell things like jazzy tights, socks, um, like the kind of thing that you'd wear on a night out and they would be the feature of the outfit. So yeah, I picked up five things from Calzedonia, so I'm going to open that as a bit of an unboxing, first impressions with you today. But I've got um, four or five items from Primark to show you, and then also a jumper and a dress, which I'm actually holding at the minute, um, from H&M. So we'll start with those pieces. So. If that's the kind of thing you want to enjoy, keep on watching and um, it'd be great if you could give this video a thumbs up if you enjoy it. So, the first item I want to show you is this H&M dress, <laughs> which is what I'm holding. Um, so you can get this in black and I would say this is a very light beige, like almost like a light mushroom colour. Um, it's a bit sexy, but I'm going to pair this with like an oversized cardigan over the top. Um, I was going to pick up a new one in H&M to go with it as a complete new outfit yesterday but then I realised I was trying that on in like a, um, a light brown colour and then I realised I already had that cardigan in a mid grey tone so I thought that would go really nice with this. So it comes to below my knee, I'm 5 foot 5.5, 5. Um, yeah it's very plain, it's not see through and then there's silk, um, sorry there's lace detail around the front and around the back. Now, I paid 17 99 for this yesterday. Slightly annoying because when I went on the website last night just to have a, a look at a few things and put some things in my basket so I know they're there for if the, you know, as and when the sale hits. This is currently in the sale. If you remember at H&M you can get like pre-sale discounts for £9. So I'm a little bit annoyed that I paid £18 yesterday but hey ho, because I do want to wear it either tonight because um, I'm going out with my friend, or tomorrow, I'm going out with my friends tomorrow. So, yeah, if you like it, they also do it in black, and I just think it would be a nice way to kind of dress up a cosy outfit. Um, I might even put some of the tights on that I, I open up from Calzedonia. So that's the first item from H&M, and I got that in a size small, so I'm a UK 8 to 10 at the moment, so I got that in a small and it's still, you can still move around in it, it's not very, um, you know, it's not restricted in any way in a size small. Um, what shall I show you next? I'll stay with H&M. This jumper, I'm pretty sure this is the one that I saw Lydia Millen wearing on her YouTube channel. Um, but this is again from H&M. Um, it's a grey jumper, very fluffy, but not itchy. And um, doesn't have like, even though the little bits are hanging off it a little bit, you know, like a fluffy Fair Isle jumper does. It's not shedding any hair, which I've got. I've got a mulberry cardigan and that sheds like nobody's business. You can't wear leggings with that because it will molt all over. Whereas this, I don't think you're going to have that problem. Anyway, it's um, round neck, slouchy neck, should I say. I picked this up in an extra small because um, I didn't want it too oversized. It's really tricky at the minute. When you've lost weight, I've been in between sizes all throughout the year and I've been the same size now for, I don't know, at least six months um, or around six months. But... It's kind of like some things are meant to be oversized, but I don't want them to be so oversized because I want to show off my weight loss. It's, it, it's tricky, but um, I was comfortable in an extra small. And to be honest, it doesn't really look like an extra small, does it? So I think it must come oversized a little bit. This was twenty four ninety nine, um, and yeah, I really like that. Took it into high waisted jeans as well for a more slouchy look. But also, I was thinking I could put this over. Well, I'm also going to show you something else in the set that I was thinking that I could put over this. But, let's get this the right way around. Let's, like, make that into, it looks like a skirt. Another cosy outfit. Could be a Christmas Day effort, you know, this one. But otherwise, I might wear it tomorrow, because I'm going to the Christmas markets in Sheffield with my friends. So, yeah, 24 99 I'm so pleased I got my hands on it, because, like I say, I was really in love with it as soon as I saw Lydia Millen wearing it on her YouTube. So... The last piece of clothing, the other items are all accessories other than the Calz um, Calzedonia. I've got to get that right, I'm new to the brand. Um, obviously they're accessories anyway. So, 
This is Primark. Picked it up in a small £10. It is like perf like an aubergine, like a deep aubergine colour with a lighter metallic thread through it. Again, not itchy. Um, V-neck slash slightly. I might, when, when you're in it, um, I did try it on yesterday when I got home, but slightly sweetheart neck, but more, slightly more V-neck on this one. Um, it's stretchy. But it's fitted as well. Um, long sleeve obviously. Has it got little cuffs on this? So like tiny little cuffs like that. But this is not scratchy. I don't know if I just said that. Um, yeah, I really like that for £10. I thought that was a great idea for a Christmas Day outfit. So maybe that with some black stirrup leggings on Christmas Day. A bit festive. Um, right. The final Primark bits. There's three more things from Primark. So... How cute are these flats? So it doesn't really show up on camera, but they are they are so glittery, not glittery, but they're so shiny, they catch the light so well. It's very dark, I'm sat in front of the window. Unfortunately, there's a window behind me as well, and the light's above me. But in the shop, these were just dazzling so much. Um, but yeah, for £12, if they're not already, I expect you will find something in Zara like these. Um, and they're probably, to be honest, copying some kind of design I've not I've not seen them online yet but I predict they are because they're just so designer-esque if that's the word we're gonna go with but £12 and I did see on Instagram reels last night somebody's taken a video of like what's new in Primark um, and there's a heel version of these as well with a black strap over the toe thin strap um, let me see if I've got anything similar no not really um, no back on it and then that would be the, the higher strap and the heel was only maybe three inch or something so I don't know how much they are but these were £12 the flat so I can't wait to wear those with black stirrup leggings to be honest I'll probably wear those on Christmas day next up from Primark is a hair bow now I took this off the packaging when I got home but how cute is this again I've been inspired by Lydia Miller one of my favorite youtubers and basically when you have your hair half up half down and you put your bow in like that for £2, I put that in my basket straight away. I thought that was so cute. I think, again, I'm going to wear that on Christmas Day and probably tomorrow as well for the markets. The final bit from Primark is this very chunky Bottega Green scarf. Now, they had it in blue, which was... There's a blue at the minute that you might have noticed is in all the shops. It's like um, quite, it's a quite... It's a bright blue. It's quite light. It's known as Gucci blue, or so I've read. Um... And then this is your Bottega Green. And then they've gone for a, a bright, um, what kind of pink? Brighter than this anyway. So you can get this in pink, green or blue. But it's so chunky. Now I've had a scarf like this before from Primark. I can't remember what print. I've also had one from Zara and the Zara ones molt everywhere. So I refuse to buy another one from Zara again. But this is the Primark version of how, you know, if you can relate to the chunky ones in Zara this is the same kind of quality and thickness and heaviness for six pound I thought this was beautiful I'm gonna wear it with black outfits beige outfits neutral outfits and this will be the the hero piece of the outfit when I you know when it does actually get cold it started to get warm again it? it's about I don't know saying that it is freezing today but yesterday it was like eight ten degrees so it's not scarf weather just yet so finally this is the package that just arrived from Calzedonia. Um, so, to return, remove this tape to close part of that. Okay, let's have a look. So, I spent about 40 odd pounds on Calzedonia. Um, I did have a 15% discount card with the Lorna Lux discount. I ordered it on the 2nd of December, I think. So, it has been delayed a couple of days. Um, I emailed yesterday to ask where my order was, and they got back within about three or four hours and said it's it's nearly there but the thing wasn't updating so all of a sudden when I'd inquired where it was my emails were updating so I don't know if they'd just I don't know messed around with the order on the computer somehow I don't know but uh, Hermes has delivered this this morning so that came in a an extra bit of paper packaging um right so the thing the tights that Lorna Lux was wearing um, I will get them out of the packet, is these spotty, glittery, 
polka dot tights. You can get them in gold or silver. She wore the silver, so that's what I went for. Um, I thought it was a bit more subtle than the gold. And I got them in a size... I don't know what size I got them in. Medium to large, it says on the front. Yeah. So, I believe it's an Italian brand. And these were priced at 19 95 It's a very expensive pair of tights because of the detail. Um, but, like I say, I got 15% off. But with a black skirt, I have a black silk skirt that you might have seen on a previous Instagram post um, outfit. Um, I'm going to pair them. Oh, God, I love them. So, if I come up close a bit. So, they've got like a netting material. You can tell the quality of this. You are not going to easily put your hand through these or your nails. And then, very fine dots of glitter. Yeah. Bit hard showing tights on uh, on a video, but if you stay tuned over on my Instagram, at a lot of what you fancy, you'll probably see those either either tonight or tomorrow. Oh, what am I going to wear tomorrow? It's so hard, you know. When you can mix and match a few bits now, out of the items that I've bought, I can definitely chop and change with a few bits that I've already got and make several outfits out of these. But I think I might wear these tomorrow. But anyway, we'll see. We'll see. So that was the first item. Um, I don't know if they've got a name for you to look for. Um, we'll see. If there's a name and it's on my email order, um, you know what I mean, my confirmation email, then I'll, I'll put it on screen for you. So the next item, again, 19.95, which is a bit strange to say they're the same price because there's definitely more detail on these. So these are actually classed as leggings. And they're footless. Um, they've got a nice finish to the bottom. Where are we? There we go. And yeah, so they've got like um, a crisscross design. Bear with me one second. I'm going to shut the door because oh, I've got a jingle bell reef on the back of my door. Um, but again, these are a dressy pair. Uh, they're black with silver on again. Um, I did think... They wouldn't be the same, I, th I don't know what I was thinking, maybe I was thinking they'd be more Diamante style, um, but I suppose they'd fall off and they would they would rub the tights, wouldn't they, in the wash, so, but yeah, this is more, there's more glitter to each polka dot than there is, um, than there is on the other pair, so yeah, I'm filming a video! <laughs> it's a bit of an ad hoc video, this one, um, since I only uploaded a vlogmas for in the London trip the other day. Anyway, I intend to do more YouTube videos so I just thought I need to, I need to crack on with my new year plan even though it's not new year yet. So then to fill the order a little bit, oh what's this? There's three more, oh yeah, I spotted these straight away. Um, so can you see cute little ankle socks with bows on? Special edition fashion socks, uh, $8.95. I'm guessing they're only one size, but let's have a look. So they come in this little. Oh, I got these in gold glitter. Maybe they were only one colour, I can't remember. So these are a bit special. Definitely going to have to try these on and insert a little picture. But they are so sweet. Have you seen the new Jimmy Choo's that are going around in that um, viral? kind of Jimmy Choo advent calendar that they've gifted all the major influencers. There's a pair on there in bright pink, although I think Ruby has just, Ruby, um, another person I follow on YouTube, has Ruby Holly, <laughs> has just bought them in white as her wedding shoes. Um, these remind me a lot of those, but in a sock. The length of those is slightly worrying and if they're going to be baggy on me, but we'll uh, try them on and insert a little clip and then the other one's just the same. Oh gosh, they're so cute. Got to find the right outfit for those. Tool and Fiocco Glitter Nero. It's all Italian. So, then to just fill the basket out because, like I say, I had this 15% off code and I think you got free delivery over so much. Maybe, maybe a £40 spend, that would make sense. I picked up some socks. I'm loving chunky wintry socks at the minute. Um, I got these this navy pair. 
these were, these are the price, £5.95. And then I've got this pair, which I thought would look nice with my Adenola leggings. I'm hoping that Father Christmas is going to bring me a um, brown espresso pair or set. We'll see. Um, but they would go really nice with those. So the quality feels really good. So yeah, they're the last items that I picked up. I hope you've enjoyed the video. It was only a quick one. And um, if you enjoyed it, give it a thumbs up. That'd be amazing. And if you're not already, subscribe to my channel. Um, and hopefully see you over on Instagram. So thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next video. See ya.